doors, closed the curtain, went to back, closed that curtain. And as soon as my head hit the hit window or my pillow, my, I heard my door handle pop a couple of times. Safety vest. You a truck driver? Mm -hmm. So, you mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Okay. All right. So, how long you been driving? Three years, just over three years. Just over three years. Yeah. Same company. Nope. So, what's the company that uh, that you started with, and what will be what will be the the yays and the nays of the company that you that you started? I started with? out with CR England. Uh, yeah, you don't have to go in too much yays and nays on that one. <laughs> teach you how to drive, but it's on a contract. But the good thing, because I have a veteran status, I only had to do six months as opposed to nine months. Okay. Uh, they did teach me, you know, everything I needed, but I wasn't home every day. I was only home 34 hours out the week. Right. And they wouldn't allow me to be home every day after somebody had made an attempt to get in my truck one night. Mm -hmm. So I left them. I went to J.B. Hunt. That which was about an hour away from where I live. Okay. So I was home every day. I had an hour commute left, and they forced the whole 14 hours. After 14 hours, now it's rush hour. I got two hours coming back. Okay. So that was too much for me. So I let that go, and I said, let me start trying tankers. I've been with them ever since. All right. Now, since you mentioned somebody got into your truck, so that would be my they next. Tried. That would be my next question about truck safety. Now, I'm not sure if you hip to a young lady named Kamisha Thomas. She was found in her truck about two, two and a half weeks ago now. She was found dead. I think you remember something like that. Yeah. With that in mind, what's your, what's your feelings and opinions about trust safety for women out here? What do you think? It's not safe. It ain't safe at all. And, you know, I would love to go over a real road or regional, but I'm not allowed to carry. So, and then this company, I'm not allowed to have my dog with me, so... You know, I'm limited with what I can have to protect myself. So, what tips that you can give some of the women out here as far as safety goes? Uh, just be alert. You know, stay in well-lit areas and make sure you lock everything up. All right. Because if I didn't have my door locked that night, they probably would have got in. All right. What made you get, other other than the money, what made you get into trucking? Oh, that's pretty much it. <laughs> he said it's pretty much now, it. I had uh, three jobs. And I was still struggling to make ends meet, and my guy was driving. And he said, you know, just try driving. If you don't like it, you can always go back to doing what you're doing. And I've been driving ever since. Ever since. Yep. Do you think trucking is good for women? Oh, yeah. Definitely. What's your opinions on it? Um, it's work. You know, you're going to have your ups and downs. I don't care what you're doing. And right. But being in a male-dominated career field, you got to put up with a little bit more than you would in a traditional job. The ones that give me the hard time, I hate to say, are black men. I got they give you. me the hardest time. I got you. You know, it's like I'm not there to take over their job. We work for the same company, so I don't need all of those. And last but not last but not least, since you've been in the field for three years, what is the craziest, most unexpected thing have ever happened to you while trucking? And I know one of them is which somebody tried to get into your truck. So you want to elaborate on that? Or you want to elaborate on something else? No, that was pretty much it. I uh, had to line up. You know how they line up on the ramps at the rest areas? Mm -hmm. I had to line up on the ramp. And I locked my doors, closed the curtain, went to back, closed that curtain. And as soon as my head hit the hit window, or my pillow, my, I heard my door handle pop a couple of times. And now that's kind of scary right yeah. there. That is kind of scary. Well, what's your name? Rikita. Rikita, thank you very much. My name is LaShawn.